Welcome back again to Bent Out of Shape, your do-it-yourself resource for metal art. Today we are going to be making a lady pub. Uh, painting will be a different episode, but at least we'll get it assembled today. So I was fortunate enough to have a helper today, so it's better for me to narrate versus putting my hood down and trying to tell you what's going on. So we start this out with a water cup, a cattle water cup from a barn. We've got a brand new one, so if you want to get a little closer here. They're all different ones, but we always try to use a round one on top. They make flat ones. They don't look just quite as nice. So this one will be a little bit different than the one we had previous made, but we prepped a little ring around here to weld the legs to because that cast iron is not always weld the best. So this just makes it a whole lot better, more durable. We took the head part and we got a bolt prepped in there so it fits in there properly. So once Austin starts assembling and putting the legs on there, um, you'll see how this all goes together. The antenna will come right off of here. So we're going to let Austin do his thing here. And you have feet pre-bent, pre-cut. Feet pre-bent, and like I said, we put a little prep work into the, into the head itself, just so it fits nice. I mean, there's a million different ways you can drill a hole and put the head on there. That's a pre-bought hemisphere from uh, King... King Industries or King Supply. They've got all kinds of things like that you can buy. So Austin's gonna snug that up. Then we use a two by four as a spacer to get the leg spacing right so it sits decent. When you got six, six rebar feet, they don't always sit the nicest. So he's got that like so. And now he's gonna start to, he's probably gonna wanna put that a little farther in Austin because these legs will come way down here. So now I'll start tacking the six legs on there. It'll only take a minute or so. Once he gets them all tacked on top, he'll flip it over and add more weld underneath so it's good and durable. So chances are when these get handled at home, they get Tossed around. Tossed around a little bit. And there's room not a right or wrong way to put the feet on. Six feet, space them out. Okay, now flip it and add weld right away to it. Yeah, sometimes they... Oop, lost one, but that's okay. That's what I was saying about the cast iron. It doesn't always weld the nice. Now I'll flip it up, add well. Once we get the legs welded on, and we know they're good and solid, we tip her over. There you go. And we pre bend these crazy little antenna. 
And we've made them a few different ways. These seem to be the nicest looking. Tip them back slightly. Why don't you tack one on once, Austin? Okay. Yeah, blast them solid. And then we put the mustache on, as I call it. And what is the mustache? Well, that's just the, in, or not the antenna, the, the mouth of the, the mouth of the ladybug. This is a spring, just a spring. And all springs are different and they don't all weld the same, but that one seems to weld pretty good. It's a pretty beefy spring. So he'll just touch that up with the grinder a little bit. And uh, down the road, we're gonna do a, a painting video where you see we had the, after we painted up orange, we had the black spots. We put eyes on our signature eyes, and there you got your finished product. So if you like the content you see today, please like and subscribe to our channel, and we'll continue to do things like this. Thank you.